Welcome back to the channel. I'm the host John Chef. This is my C7 Corvette channel. Today's video is going to be about the uh, up and coming uh, uh, new uh, uh, E Ray. E Ray uh, Corvette is coming out. As you know, uh, GM has uh, uh, filed a uh, patent for the trademark of. Uh, uh, E-Ray and uh, E-Ray e is going to be a, uh, a hybrid hybrid vehicle putting out about a thousand horsepower and it's going to be a uh, it's going to be replacing the uh, the Grand Sports model and I think we're we expecting the uh, E-Ray to make her debut in uh, 2023 from, from what I can tell from uh, uh, GMAuthority.com. In 2020, 22, 2023, uh, we should be uh, seeing the uh, uh, Z06 coming out. And following, it, following it, the uh, Z06 model, uh, that's going to be the Zora model. And the Zora model should be coming out in like 2025. After the Zora model is going to be a, uh, a completely uh, uh, electrical, electrical vehicle. And it's not going to be in the more uh, uh, flat, flat crank, uh, dry slump uh, engine anymore. You're not going to be able to uh, uh, get in your vehicle and, and wrap it up uh, as I can you know, with this. Uh, uh, C7. Uh, everything seems to be changing now. Uh, uh, and uh, they're going to, uh, everybody seems to be getting on board with this. Uh, going to completely uh, uh, electronic or uh, le electrical, uh, uh, electrical vehicle. And uh, I, I'm e eagerly anticipating uh, myself how this is going to work. Because you know when you have a uh, when you have a sports car, you want to uh, uh, get down on your car and, and wrap it up sometime. And me being old school, I have a uh, manual transmission seven speed, and uh, most people can't most people they can't even can't even drive a uh, a, a manual. Uh, so to me, a uh, sports car is not really a sports car uh, if you can't uh, shift the gears uh, yourself. Uh, so they're coming, they're coming out with this uh, coming out with this new model, and uh, I guess we just have to see how that's going to how that's going to play out uh, in in the corporate corporate world, and we we have to see if. Uh, if it's going to affect the uh, uh, customer customer base, it probably it probably won't because of uh, the customer base now is uh, uh, seem to be shifting to a uh, to a much uh, much younger uh, generation. Uh, the Corvette uh, uh, prior to the uh, prior to the C8, uh, most of the people that. Uh, that uh, purchase of Corvette was was probably uh, uh, 50 or uh, either older. Uh, those were the only one that actually that could uh, uh, purchase uh, purchase such a vehicle. But uh, now the uh, geographic uh, age range now for these uh, vehicles since they come out with a mid engine is. Uh, Seem to be changing to a uh, to a much uh, younger to a much younger younger crowd. So as I say, we are just in, anticipating how this is going to work out. I won't I won't make any judgment about it. I just have to just wait and see when the vehicle, vehicle vehicles come out and see whether or not I'm, I want to continue with the. Uh, with the uh, Corvette uh, brand or uh, 
I'll go on to something else. Uh, but for now, I'm, I'm sticking with it. I'm sticking with my my uh, uh, stingray. And if I decide to go get me another one, and if I don't, I don't like if I don't like the uh, C8, then I probably will, uh, um, maybe get me a 2019 uh, uh, Z06 or either. Uh, 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 ZR, ZR, ZR1, uh, if I can find one, because those are those people, they're, uh, kind of, uh, uh, kind of hard to find the ZR1, because people don't, once people get those vehicles, they don't, um, they don't really let them go too fast like they do the, uh, uh, the base model, Stingray, uh, the Grand Sport, the Z06, uh, the Grand Sport, uh, the Z06, uh, uh, most owners of, of these vehicles don't even, uh, don't even keep these vehicles uh, uh, past or, or either up to 50,000 miles. It's, it's, it's rarely you see a Corvette owner that actually owns one of these cars and, and keep it to the to that to the have that kind of that kind of miles on. Uh, and to me, I think these people are, uh, are not really. Uh, I, I want to say Corvette owners, but they just haven't really uh, just enjoyed it, enjoyed their vehicle. Uh, the vehicle has been mostly just a uh, a garage cream because uh, they haven't haven't driven it, and and, and just, they just make it out just a just a weekend car. And uh, me myself, these cars these cars cost too much. Uh, just to be something that's driven on, on the weekend. Well, I do. I do use my vehicle as a daily driver, as I always state. And the only reason why I use it as a daily driver is because I blew, I blew the end up in my in my pickup truck. So I have to, uh, I have to use my. Uh, my Corvette to uh, you know get me to my uh, get me to my customers and uh, this is this is what I do uh, uh, in the commercial commercial cleaning uh, cleaning in industry and uh, this is what this is what pays the bills for me and uh, the cost of this the cost of this industry is uh, it's why I own a uh, well, I'm, well, that's how I'm able to uh, to afford this uh, to afford this vehicle. Another thing too about these this particular vehicle. I can drive it up to like 5,000 miles before she's uh, uh, actually have to go in for an oil change. But the new C8, the C8, you can drive them up to like 7,000 7, or either 7,500 miles, something like that, uh, before they do for an oil change. And, uh, man, I, I don't know how that works. Uh, uh, you driving a vehicle that, that long uh, before it do for an oil change, but I guess that's the... Uh, that's today's uh, uh, technology. Uh, cars nowadays are not the, uh, the cars or, or the vehicle of, of old. The way you have to, you know, uh, change out your oil every three thousand miles and and get a tune-up, you know, like every every ten thousand miles. Uh, this 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 ain't the same kind of vehicle. Well, this is John Shaft. This is my C7 Corvette channel. I'll make this video kind of uh, short today. Uh, hit the like button, share button, and subscribe to my channel. So you know when I'm doing the upload.
usual. I thank you for watching my channel. And uh, I'll see you again in the next video upload. You guys be safe out there. And always, always remember, stop dreaming and start driving your new Corvette. Thank you for watching.